Okay, since we did a, a switcheroo, since nobody cared of uh, voting, so I had to go on and randomly choose. Well, even though we just did that, and now we're doing the Green Galaxy Ranger. Um, this uh, is not Damon Henderson either. I know, I, I know, you guys don't like uh, my fan-made characters because you guys don't know, know know nothing about their background or history or anything. Because uh, I've been doing these Power Rangers, well, fan fiction wise, for like, I actually, I've been doing Power Rangers Lost Galaxy for those who haven't noticed, um, for uh, for a fan fiction comic book series, and I've been doing them for like, I've been doing these Power Rangers for years after its after its uh um season uh, finished uh, airing on Fox Kids. Anyway, let me. I don't want to carry on. This is the Green Galaxy Ranger. But it was supposed. Well, based on the actor casting, I was thinking that if this was going to be Damon Henderson. Of course, Damon Henderson is black, and he was the Green Galaxy Ranger. Why do you think you've got his helmet right next to his, uh, right next to him? But the answer is no. This is my Green Galaxy Ranger that I made up for my Power Rangers fan fiction universe, which is centered around me. If I was a Power Ranger, but in which I'm not in real life, because Power Rangers are not real. They only exist on the TV show. The video games, action figures, and of course the two cinematic, uh, cinematically released films that we still have now. I know it's been, you know, 17, 16, 17 years since uh, Tur uh, Power Rangers had, had had another movie in theaters. And even though Turbo Power Rangers movie nearly killed it. And killed Power Rangers not having another opportunity to make another movie. For, theater, for a theater release knowing that Turbo was a box office bomb. And such carry on now my cast my fan casting for the green galaxy ranger was going to be tone loke tone lock actually um you know tone loke the guy who sung the song wild thing you know as my choice but he's too old for the role and then well if you remember from my rise of turkina videos i had charlie charlie murphy charlie murphy's uh, face on, on the green rangers body um earlier but last year, following the Blue Galaxy Rangers' orig original casting choice, I dropped Charlie as well. Sadly, oh. So um, now guess who I stuck? Guess who I ended up with? Don Cheadle. Yep, Don Cheadle, aka the guy who played uh, War Machine, aka uh, Rody, uh, Cody Ro. Uh, I mean, not Cody Rose. I mean, Rody, Rody Rhodes, or whatever his name was in Iron Man. Two, and also Iron Man Three, even though Iron Man Three does come out in theaters uh, this summer, May second, two thousand, uh, or was it May third, May fourth, of two thousand thirteen. Um, he was in several other movies. I didn't catch uh, Don in, but I did see I did see Don Cheadle make a cameo appearance, um, and have a small bit in Rush Hour Two as uh, Kenny, one of uh, James Carter's uh, friends, in this uh, what was supposed to be a Chinese restaurant. And, James Carter's case. And I didn't think that his character can actually do martial arts in this movie. I mean, in that movie. For, but even though for a small bit. Um, my Green Galaxy Ranger is not going to be like Damon Henderson, which was Re Reggie Rolls' character from the TV show. My Green Galaxy Ranger is exactly like Ginga Green and Ginga Man. Hayate Hi uh, or... I guess that's how you pronounce them. And there we go again with this shit. Dad always cut me off. I forgot what I was about to say about him. Oh, yeah. Damon was... The, like I said, Damon was the... Mechanic of Terra Venture. He was, you know, but when, when... When he became the Green Galaxy Ranger, and when the Rangers wanted him to do, uh... These certain missions to lure the villains away from him... They always gotta pick Damon as the decoy. Why couldn't they choose? I mean, why do you think? Why do you think for for for, for God's sakes? Why why couldn't Damon? Why couldn't Damon choose Kai to be the decoy? But no, despite the fact that Damon doesn't like doing anything much, he all he ever complained. Well, well, like as seen in the Lights of Ryan and Journeys in Part One, when well in Journeys in when he had to lure Trakina to bring her Scorpion Stinger ship to Terra Venture. He always he had to complain. Why the fuck? Why why does he have to? Why does I have to be the decoy? But what I would have said if he said it, if I dub dubbed that scene, it would be like, why the fuck I have to be the decoy all the time? But a fucking distraction. Man, this ain't right, yo. Something like that. But, um, knowing that it's a kid's show, I can't use that kind of language. Now, um, 
I think I well, I couldn't think of any other actors following my uh, termination of fan casting on Char- Charlie Murphy being my Green Galaxy Ranger when I did do the Rise of Trakina for those who still refuse to under who still refuse to uh, uh, accept my creativity on that project from three years ago now since it's been three years since I've done the Rise of Trakina and still no uh, feedback from anybody. Um, so I had to choose Don Cheadle, and I got rid of Charlie Murphy, so Don Cheadle was my next candidate, casting candidate. Um, now, uh, let's put on his helmet. Um, unlike the Blue Rangers' uh, head, pl- uh, Blue Rangers' head plate on Josh Cook's face, because, you know, the uh, when I printed out uh, these photos of the faces up, their heads were small, smaller than the Ranger head, head plates themselves. So, of course, I was going to bring up his Quasar Saber, but his uh, Condor Quasar Saber, but I didn't want to. And there we go. No, I'm really, you know, I also wanted to, uh, I was kind of, you know, for a nostalgic reason and something in real life, I really don't want to talk about the Green Ranger and Trakinos' relationship. I mean,. I mean, I know in Ging, I know in Ginga Man, Ginga Green and um, Shalinda are enemies, but in the Power Rangers version, I mean, seriously, why the fuck did the Green Ranger marry Trakina if Trakina hates the Power Rangers? But even though that was only in character, but Reggie and Amy in real life are married. But if, well, I like I said when when I wanted to do the script, should I have the Green Ranger have a relationship with, with Trakina in this reboot movie? But I said Trakina will not be in this movie. So the answer is no. I'm not using her. Sorry. I will not use her in this movie. Because if you guys haven't heard, if you guys are refusing to understand where I'm coming from with the casting and why, wh- wh- where I'm doing this movie, but you guys, don't under- you guys refuse to understand and don't care. So, um... And also... I'm lacking a lot of female. I'm lacking uh, female casting choices, and if there, like I kept saying, is there any female uh, YouTube users out there that would like to do my movie? But the answer is no. I have no feedback. This is mostly I'm getting a lot of male feedback from the uh, demographics of males, the number of males on YouTube. So, so that's what. So despite the fact that I've been having dead. Feedback from female users on YouTube. I decided no Trakina for Power Rangers Lost Galaxy, the movie 2014. So that's why I decided to go on finding casting choices for the Pink Ranger instead. I don't have nothing much to say about Damon. It's just he's very, uh, he's not really that funny as the Green Ranger. I mean, the jokes he made, like in Destined for Greatness, when he complimented about um, Mike when he bought the, uh, when he um, received the powers of the Magna Defender and when he got the Toro Zord and saying, like, this joke that wasn't really that fun that was a little funny when he said a bull it ain't that way it ain't that far cool than a condor or whatever he said or but my version of the green ranger is not going to be like damon he's going to be completely serious and completely like his sentai counterpart where he's completely serious but blue ranger on the other hand is going to be the goofball because I because I want these characters to be like their Sentai counterparts and equivalents, even though Saban's is, uh, versions of of uh, Ginga Man for Power Rangers were portrayed differently. Well, except Leo, but even though the Pink Ranger, the the Pink, Yellow, Blue, and Green Galaxy Rangers were were portrayed differently, so that's why I've always preferred the Red Galaxy Ranger the best of the team of the team's bunch, and also Corone as well because she was more like her Sentai well her Ginga Man counterpart. When she was the Pink Ranger, but even though when in space uh, used uh, and utilized uh, Mega Ranger footage, Astronema was just like her Mega Ranger counterpart, but Astronema is 100% American produced. So here's here's how I'm going to do these characters. If you uh, have mentioned or if if you haven't even been mentioned already, my version of the Blue Ranger is going to be you know a, a, a co- the comic relief of the team. The Green Ranger is you know he, you know strict and doesn't like. Playing pl- uh, doesn't like playing around and plays by the books and plays by the rules, and he's he could be a pain in the ass at times and yeah so that's all I have to show you. Until next time, folks. When I get the chance, since I've only got three Power Rangers down, three more to go. Well, two more to go. Sant plus the Magna Defender. Um, I'm probably gonna do. 
pinky necks with, fa with the facial likeness of Katie Cassidy. Until next time. So see ya. Comment and also subscribe to our channel to my channel for uh, more updates on my Power Rangers Los Galaxy fan film because it, it's been a while since I've done these uh, case study episodes. So see you later until when I probably get a chance to do the Pink Ranger sometime.